Well, here we are again. After a very mediocre summer, the mornings are getting darker and the days shorter. Welcome to autumn. Normally after a hot summer, I welcome the change of season, but a bit like the last two years or so, everything seems to be blended into one. Well, what is the South Coast property market doing as things cool down, you ask? Over the last three months, according to CoreLogic, the major cities have slowed or gone slightly negative in price growth and auction clearances have dropped. Canberra was one of the exceptions, with a further 3.1% increase over the last quarter. Regional areas combined still had a 5.1% increase over the last quarter. I feel the market has peaked and the prices will hold for the foreseeable future, but as more property comes to market compared to the last two years, time on market will increase and auction clearances will drop. It's not a major concern, but it does increase the need to market the property through a knowledgeable agent with a solid agency backup and a well-designed marketing plan. Along with professional pictures and marketing videos as provided by my preferred team at South Coast Picks, the days of just putting up the property on the net with an average presence and waiting for the calls are diminishing, I believe. Just a case study. Over the last four months, I have auctioned seven of my listings. Three have sold with strong pre-auction offers, three sold under the hammer, and the last one just recently failed to sell on the day. But with some negotiation, just after a deal was struck, which was both the buyer and the vendor were happy with, with one of the auction attendees. This, I believe, backs up my point. A slightly cooling market where there is larger selection of properties available. Present, there are some disruptive influences which can affect the market. One is the war in Europe. Though far away, it has a negative influence on the world as a whole. Federal elections also seem to create uncertainty. And there are some small interest rate rises in the wind. But put into perspective, the rates are still going to be at historical low for quite a time, I feel. On the positive side, a strengthening economy, extra incentives in the budget for first home buyers, plus a return of migrants should help offset some of the slowing demand. In wrapping up, no matter if you are a buyer or a seller, it's well worthwhile getting some qualified advice from one of the five linked LJ Hooker offices in the Eurobadala. Well, that's it from Rob Routledge from the Bay Office and please don't hesitate to give me a call on 0414 No matter whether it's a block of land in town or a 200 acre farm, I'll look after your best interest. Bye till winter calls.